Hi everybody, I've got a tool here for the Android that I think is useful for Uber drivers. I'm going to make a crappy video here, sorry about the video quality, I don't have any better equipment than this webcam, to show you what it is. <clears throat> it's called Tasker, and it's this icon right here. Uh, looks like a uh, little gear, and I think it's only for Android. Sorry, um, iPhone people, but, you know, that's too bad for you. Basically, you know how you have a, 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 a dedicated phone number for your Uber passengers that connects to your passenger when you're going to pick them up? I, I think Lyft does the same thing. Um, I seem to have more trouble, though, with Uber knowing exactly where passengers are located. And so I like to send them a text when I'm after I've accepted their, their, their pickup. So I send them a text. Um, here's what the texts look like. It says, hello, this is Aaron. So you can see, I don't know if you can really read that. It says, hello, this is Aaron, your Uber driver on my way. Please confirm your location. Now, when I send this now, since I'm not logged into the app and I don't have a customer, the text I get back is an error has occurred. Okay. Um, but it does work very well. It'll actually be the text that whatever they reply with, like I'm in front of the McDonald's. Okay. Uh, so what this, uh, these two things I did with Tasker does is one, it sends them a text and two, any replies from, I have a contact, <clears throat> if you can see here, I have a contact named Uber passenger. Okay. And, um, and it has the special Uber number for me as its phone number. So if I, one of the things I set up with ta Tasker, and I'll show you how this works, is if I click this thing that says UP greeting text, it says UP greeting text, that icon, it sends them that text, and then if they reply, another function in Tasker reads it back out loud, which is nice because if I'm on the way driving, I don't want to be reading texts, but if my phone suddenly talks to me, that's perfectly okay. So I'm going to give you a demonstration. Just realize that the reply is going to be an error has occurred, okay? An error has appeared. And yeah, it pronounces the word occurred funny. But you can see how they're very useful. I found this very useful last night. So I'm going to show you how to set this up, okay? First of all, you have to get Tasker, and Tasker costs like $2.99. It's not too bad. So if you open up Tasker, the first thing you need to do is you need to create a profile. And a profile is basically a trigger for something to happen. And you just hit this little plus button. And I created one called received. It's an event. And it's a received text. It's any type of text. And if you click this little uh, search thing here, you can choose which contact you want. Okay. And then after you make it, it'll make you create a task. Uh, there's a list of tasks, tasks here. But... Um, I've had this do everything. I'm like using it to log my diet and all kinds of things. But anyways, the task I have is called read text out loud. And what it does, it does a couple of things. First, it increases the media volume, which is, uh, the volume I'm using for this. It makes a beep noise. It then reads out the body of the text out loud, and then it sets the volume back to something normal so that I, other things that happen aren't freaking me out. So let me show you what each of these does. The media volume, I just told it to change it to 12 and that's it. The beep, um, I lowered the frequency because the 8,000 um, <clears throat> setting, which is the default, is really high in piercing. And I, I reduced the, the duration really low because the, fir the, the, the default duration is 1,000 milliseconds, which is the first full second. And that's like just this loud second-long screech. So I made it lower and I made it really short, okay? And then the say part is where it actually you're telling it to say something. <clears throat> and I told it to say... Um, so if you click, the, if you press this little uh, thing here, you get a list of things that it could say, and um, it's going to say the text body, and that's what I chose, and because it knows that it was triggered off of a text arriving from Uber passengers, so it knows it's going to say that, and the rest I left the same, and I left it stream media. That's which type of volume it's using, which is why when I changed the media volume before, and then I here's where I just switched the media volume back. Um, this works really nicely. So literally, I accept the call, I hit this, it sends them a text that says, Hi, I'm Aaron, please confirm your location. An error has 
And they'll come back. I'm in front of Rick's dessert diner or I'm in front of McDonald's or something. Um, and it just reads it out automatically. And it only works if it's from Uber passenger. As I said, you could probably do the same thing with Lyft, making a, 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 a contact called Lyft passenger. But Lyft seems to be a little better at telling you actual addresses, whereas Uber has a tendency to just tell you someone's on somewhere on some city block. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. I'll try to answer them. Okay, thanks. Bye. Hi, so I realized I forgot to show you how to make the greeting message in Tasker. And it's still the same thing. You go into Tasker and you create an, you, you just create a tech, a task. You don't have to create a, a, a trigger. And it's just a, tr a task called UP greeting text. And all it really has is it has the send SMS. And you have to, if you choose, just go, once again, just hit the little search thing and find the, the contact you want, but it'll actually put the number in, and then just type in the text, and that's it. And then, um, and then I have this thing that says flash, and it's actually on, under the notification thing. That just gives me a thing, a little, little security that it actually sent the text so that I know something happened. That's all it is. Hi, and then the way you trigger the, uh, actual text is you just go in here and you find a widget uh, there's a widget in here that's like tasker shortcut and uh, 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 it's in here someplace la 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 there you go task shortcut and when you create the shortcut it'll ask you when you do this you just draw this and you just drop it here and it'll bring up the list of the things and you say okay I just want UP greeting test task and 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 that's all it is and so it does that so um i just and it'll ask you to create uh, an i choose an icon and you just choose it off the list and it's whichever one you want i just happen to choose that one okay bye